Hi, and thanks for joining me today. Well, if you ever wondered how people make their money decision, especially when nobody's looking, you know, what is behind the financial choices, both good and bad, that we make? Well, our work has found that many of those choices are shaped by something we call our money scripts. Those are the unconscious beliefs that we all hold about money. Most of these beliefs are partial truths. We tend to follow them blindly, almost like we're on autopilot, because we're not consciously aware with them. And just like a script for a play, these beliefs are often written by a playwright, by someone else, and we end up memorizing them for delivery in the financial play of our life. The problems start when the play basically our financial circumstances change, but our lives or our beliefs don't. Money scripts deeply influence what we do around money. They are especially significant in keeping us stuck in self-destructive cycles of financial behavior, such as overspending, hoarding, accumulating, uh, debt, being overly fearful about the future, uh, failing to plan for the future at all. One important aspect of the integrated financial planning work that I do is to help clients identify and understand their money scripts. Once we learn about these hidden beliefs, we can look at the aspects uh, of those scripts which are true or not true. And then we can begin to actually rescript them or change them, modify them, add flexibility to them. This is really an important step toward making healthier, more balanced money choices. Now for the first time, a survey has been, de been designed uh, by my colleagues, uh, Drs. Ted and Brad Klontz, to help uh, identify more clearly which money beliefs are tied to specific money behaviors. This survey is going to be distributed online to several thousand people and maybe for the first time we're going to get a clue into uh, a broad swath of individuals money scripts and to see uh, which money scripts may be the more popular um, perhaps there's some universal money scripts we don't know but this survey is an opportunity to participate in research that will help financial planners, financial coaches, financial therapists work more effectively with their clients. It will be featured in an upcoming book uh, which we have uh, yet to uh, name uh, the title. I think it's probably going to be due out in 2009. It's also a chance for you by taking the survey to learn more about your own money beliefs and how those beliefs affect the way that you handle your money. Now if you'd like to be part of this research, and I hope that you will be part of it, you can access the survey through the Kaler Financial Group website. Just go to www.kalerfinancial.com, that's K-A-H-L-E-R, financial.com, and look for the link on the home page. Uh, you could also access this through my blog, which is at www kfgblog.com but I think the website will be an easier way to to get to it. Completing the uh, survey is going to take you about 20 minutes. Uh, some of the questions relate to demographic information such as age and your level of education, family income and the like. Uh, obviously that information is important uh, to the survey uh, but it will be analyzed only as group data. No responses are going to be identified individually. No identifying information will be collected or kept. That's important that you know that. Any survey participants who uh, want to do so can register to win one of 10 $25 gift certificates. Uh, this is just a way of thanking people for taking the time to complete the survey. And those who register are going to be asked to provide an email address or other contact information. Again, we promise that the information will not be saved, shared, or used for any purpose except notifying winners of the gift certificates. 
participants are not going to get emails trying to sell them insurance, financial services, vacation, cruises, uh, or anything else. The results of this survey, as I said, are going to be included in the uh, new book on money scripts. Uh, Drs. Klontzes and I are currently working on the book. It's going to be uh, published by Health Communications. I'll also publish a summary of the survey in a future column and uh, make sure it's on my blog and website. Now, if you're interested in taking part of this survey, please do so soon. The closing date is June 15th. We'll greatly appreciate your helping to accumulate this very important data. We also believe that you're going to learn some interesting things about yourself that will help you build a more balanced relationship with your money. Thanks for joining me today.